We had an office meeting the other day. What is happening with this hair here? What's going on? I gotta look good for camera. Whoa. Keep forgetting to. I don't need to slouch. Sorry, mom. It's me. It's me, Kristen Coots. Hopefully, hopefully you knew that. If not, hello. I'm Kristen. Nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. Pleasure is all mine. Welcome. Hello. This is your first video. I hope it's not your last. If this is your second video, consider yourself a subscriber. I always feel like I need to introduce myself. So hello, I'm Kristen. My name is Kristen Coons. I'm a real estate agent for Julie Woods and Associates. And this is real estate talk video number two, number three. I don't actually know. I forget. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I don't know. Listen, a lot of folks have been asking me, you know, hey, Kristen, what's been going on in the real estate market? And so I figured I would let you in on the hot gossip. Okay. And by hot gossip, I mean, this is all statistically supported. So straight facts. I've got invaluable resources on my end and I want to be able to, my heart is just to be able to share with you what I learned so that I can be a trusted resource for you to rely on, depend on, count on. I'm sure you're wondering, what does that have to do with me, Kristen? Well, I actually, I don't know. It may have nothing to do with you, but it, it most likely has something to do with somebody that you know. And so you may not be looking for a house or you may not be looking to sell your house, but I guarantee somebody in your sphere of influence is. This information would be something to send to them. So for those of you who have been sitting on pins and needles waiting for me to tell you this. <laughs> okay. Yes, the market is still crazy. This is how it compares to last year, just to give you a good idea of, you know, what, what this actually means when we say the market is crazy. In August 2020, we had 708 listings. And in, in August of 2021, we had 523. So there's an inventory shortage big time. In August 2020, 193 houses closed. We had 221 houses closed this past August. So as far as volume goes, sales are up by 14.5%. That's insane. In August 2020, the median price was 185,000. We're currently at 230,000. In August 2020, the average days on the market was 104 and it is now 79. In August 2020, the average price per square foot was $98.71 and it's currently $120.40. That's a 22% increase. In August 2020, the median square footage was 1953 and it is now 1983. In August 2020, the list to close price was 95.36% and it's currently at 98.29%. So not everything is selling above list price as it once was. I mean, is that crazy or what? If your house is worth $750,000 or less, it will be on the market for 3.7 months. The bulk of sales right now are in the 200 to 250,000 range. And these houses are staying on the market for an average of 1.8 months. That's including the contract period. So, whoa. Be out by Thanksgiving, be out by Christmas. Now's the time to do it. Now's the time to do it. If you or someone you know is looking to buy, we are actually anticipating it becoming a buyer's market by the end of next year. So if you're financing, this matters because your affordability and the amount that you can buy will decrease and you will be paying more in interest. Please feel free to pass this information on to anybody that you know, tag people, share it, do whatever your little heart desires. I'm looking for referrals. As always, I'm looking to be your trusted resource, somebody that you can turn to for all of your real estate needs. Will you keep me in mind? If you hear of anybody looking to buy a house, looking to sell a house, looking to just learn more about what's going on in the market, looking for a lender, whatever it is, I think I probably sound like a broken record, but my entire business is built around word of mouth referrals. You know, I'm very dependent on people like you. Thank you so much for just supporting me and encouraging me and trusting me and just staying with me on my journey. Whoop. Need to mute that, sorry. I don't ever know how to end these videos. <laughs> so I'm just gonna awkwardly laugh at the camera and then say bye-bye.